boxingverse.com live here with Hot Rod. So help me with the pronunciation of this name. I, I just always go with Hot Rod, but I feel like it's Rajvad? Radivoya Kalajic. Oh, Radivoya Kalajic. Yeah, there you go. So you just got a big win over Sullivan Barrera. This is probably the biggest name on your resume. Yeah. How does it feel to be the A side finally? Because you've been in this position where you're fighting a bigger name, but you've been the B side. Today, you were the A side in this fight and came away with the win, a knockout win, an explosive. That really highlight real because you knocked him out the ring. For sure, for sure. I didn't, I didn't pay attention to the B side or A side, so I don't really have nothing to say about that. Uh, I, I was, dang, I was going in like I was the B side because he has more uh, amateur pedigree and he has more experience. So he was he's coming in with an advantage already, so that's how I was thinking. Did you feel his time out the ring, or was he as fresh as you expected him to be? Well, I, don't, I don't know. We sparred like seven years ago, eight, so I don't know how this is his best or his worst. So I can't really tell you that. But uh, even if he was his best or worst, it's all of him how I do. So if I did my game plan the way I was supposed to, the fight was going to come out good regardless. You've been in the division for a while. You did get an opportunity versus better be. That didn't come your way. Um, what are you looking for now? Man, anybody, any being in the top 10, uh, any any uh, promoter, uh, if I can't get no big fights, I'm going to stay, keep staying busy at uh, Pro Box. I was hoping you was going to call David Benavidez out. He's making an uh, introduction into your division. June 15th, he should be fighting. Former champion Alexander Vazdek, what do you think of a potential fight with you and David? Well, I would love that fight. Like I said, I'm I'm a, with the pro box, but uh, uh, I could work with any promoter, so I could fight on any promotional company. So David Benavidez or Grozik, if he wins, anybody, obviously Bivol and Better Beef are tied up, so I can't. Two fights. Yeah, yeah. So I can't two fights. So Three so that's that's the whole year for them. So anybody, Dan Aziz, Josh Ibuate, uh Yarde, Count Smith, anybody. Anthony just, Yard, you like yeah, Anthony Anybody, Yard? I just want some big fights. And you willing to travel to the UK for yeah. an Anthony Yard fight? Yeah, if the money's right, why not? <laughs> there were some rumors, was it a potential of you fighting in Saudi with Goodwin? Yeah, it was It was rumors, but he had like five, six guys lined up, so you know, it could have been anybody. And but you were I, willing to go to Saudi? Oh, for sure. It was even a short week, short camp, but you know, I, I was, I was going to be ready. Uh, what sort of danger you think you present to a guy like David Benavidez? He's going to be now the biggest name moving into the division. Arthur Benavidez is already getting old and, like you said, tied up. I, uh, I don't know. I just I think I, I box better. He's got, like I said, more experience. But uh, uh, I believe I hit harder. He he has power, but it's not where uh, he knocks people out cold with one punch. You know, he eventually breaks you down and punches and bunches. So I feel like I feel like I'm faster and and hit harder, but. You know, we'll see if we ever fight, how that fight goes. I would love to fight him. No disrespect or nothing. You know, just the business. How beneficial has this activity been to your career? You fought in September, now you're back out again in March. That's about a six-month layoff. Did you like the six months off, or would you prefer to come back quicker? No, we were supposed to fight in what, October. Yeah. October, but I had an injury, so we had to postpone. But Provox will keep me busy every two or three months. Uh, this is the business I've been in, like, six years, five, six years. I had, like, one fight a year the last four years, so... Having two months and six months, it's a blessing to me. So like I said, I was, gonna, I was supposed to fight in October, November, so that would have been even quicker, but I had an injury. So hopefully I'll be back in June or May. So we're going to keep four fights a year. All right, champ. Well, uh, congratulations, man. Shout out for the highlight reel knockout and hope to see you back soon. And thank you for the Pro Box for keeping me busy and having Appreciate my back. Thank you, guys. Right. Family, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Help us get to that million subscribers. We're on the road to a million. And... Obviously, we have other great content on our Patreon channel. So since this video is over, head on over to our Patreon and check out all the exclusive content or right here on our YouTube members.